designing in pages. One of my favorite projects so far this year has been our Aylesbury Talks Love book. We were able to capture the voices of our families along with their images and bring them all together in pages on the iPad. Some friends have asked about some quick design tips, especially as we're maybe um, trying to level up from our basic books. So this is a series of clips that will give you some quick, quick tips um, as you get designing. So here we go. Tip one is just looking at setup. Pages is going to default to basic word processing. So let's see how we can set up and customize our layout so it feels unique and just for us. So when we're adding to choose a new file, make sure you're choosing a blank book. I always go for landscape because that allows me kind of a canvas um, experience where I can mess about and do my own thing. I generally like to just delete the pages and work off a blank page just so I have free reign. So one of the features I love is that we can set up a custom size, especially uh, in this project as we're looking at photographs and really wanting to feature that photograph, feature our learners, I wanted a square layout. So in document options, I can go to my document setup and hit custom size and set up that square uh, setting. In the next tip, I'll talk about establishing a color palette for your project.